What's up guys? So we're getting an early start today. Uh, in today's video, we're going to be removing the fenders. Uh, we already got the wide body removed on Joel's BRZ. So now we're going to be removing the fenders and putting it on this car. So this is our friend Brandon's car. Um, he's going full wide body and he's taking Joel's uh, front wide body kit. So front bumper, fenders, everything. Um, and then we have some Rocket Bunny rear fenders that we're going to be putting on. So it's going to be pretty fun. Uh, we've done this before on Joel's car, so we're not new to this, but we're trying to do as good as possible. And it's going to be a little easier because we're actually swapping his fenders instead of having to cut them ourselves. That's going to be easy. And then since we're going to be giving these fenders to him, he's going to be giving his to ours. So we're going to be using his fenders for our new wide body build. So it's going to be sick. So right now, Joel is just um, removing the fender right now and then Brandon's over here cleaning his spoiler, well trunk, because we just removed his spoiler. We got a new spoiler coming um, that we have for him and we're gonna be putting on in a bit. Uh, we just need some 3M tape and yeah. So as you can see, we have a completely naked front end <laughs> on Joel's BRZ. Front bumper's off, uh, fenders are off, and we have like nothing. Like look how freaking wide these wheels are. Insane. So right now, this car is ready to get the new fenders put on it, which we're gonna start taking off of Brandon's BRZ. So once these, uh, so once we got those fenders off, we're gonna put it onto the and so this car and then we should be able to uh, wide body it soon enough so with this car we got the front bumper off uh, it was kind of a hassle just because it has so much fender liner on it uh, we're not used to all those fender liner stuff because we take it out um, so right now all we have to do is take off the fenders so once these fenders are off we're gonna be putting them onto that car and then uh, putting that car's fenders onto this one and attaching the wide body kits that are over there and we're gonna leave it green for a while until uh we go get it painted because we think it's gonna look cool so yeah but yeah let's just take a moment and look at this driveway man got a whole engine here a brandon <laughs> we got a v3 rocket bunny bumper we got rocket bunny front fenders rocket bunny rear fenders a nice brz in the garage we have my 350Z, the Nismo front bumper, just got a Tome on it, sounds sick. Uh, we got my freaking Lancer, fake Evo 10, and sheesh, looks so good over here. And then, holy grail right here, we got the wide body BRZ with the rally backer rear, the battle arrow wing on the back, NVIDIA exhaust. And like, damn, bro. Mm-hmm. 
So as per usual, Florida weather, it's already raining. Uh, we planned for it, so we got this tarp over. All right. Um, so yeah, so Joel's about to move the car, but just look how cool it looks, man. So we got Brandon over here on this side, Joel's working on that side, we're taking off the fender liner. And then once that's all off, uh, we're gonna do the, the fenders. And then once the fenders are off, uh, we can make clearance for the wheels. Oh my gosh. Look at all that stuff in there. All the way back there. That's disgusting. Let's hold it. Look at all this stuff that came off the from inside the fender. What the, what's the point of the fender liner then? If all this is gonna stay in your in between your fender and the car. That's gross, dude. clearance for some big ass wheels and if you want to run big tires and if you want to have a lot of um, camber and if you want to an air suspension. Look like this. I don't know yet. <laughs> How do you feel? How do you feel right now? I don't know. It feels so real. So quick update time, uh, we got this front wide body piece all put on, so as you can tell, and yeah, that's all mounted, so we'll go on this side, we have the fender on, we don't have the wide, wide body piece on, um, we don't have the wheel on yet, so what we're going to do now is, uh, I think we're going to put the wheel on first, then the wide body piece, because it just makes it a little bit easier, and um, then... We'll be able to put the front bumper on, close the hood, drop the car, and this thing will be all set. So let's get to it. All right, guys. So got the whole front end done. It's all wide bodied. Looks sick. Uh, everything's clearanced out. Fitment could be better, could be lower, but for right now it's fine. Um, but yeah, man, completely transformed the front of this car. It looks crazy. It looks just like how Joel had it. So old cars over here. Still got to work on it. Got the fenders over there. So I'm gonna be putting those on in a bit. But first, we want to start on the on the rear front, uh, quarter panels here. So man, it's coming out really good. Bubble wrap. All right, guys. So right now they're taking out the rear quarter panels. So these are the new ones. Oh, oh. 
Look at that. Rocket Bunny V1. Faster. Yeah, like that. That's it. Push it a little bit. Alright, now go fast. Keep Don't keep going. going. Hey! Yeah. yeah. Alright guys, so we're about to start. We're gonna be using this tool. Um, and we're just gonna go right here. <laughs> Give it a hit. Give it a hit. Give it a hit. I'm hitting the rest in this area right here. Right here, right here, right? Hey, give it a hit. Bro, just right here. <laughs> what? I don't get it. What? Oh, okay. Okay. Ah! All right, I'm done. I'm sorry. <laughs> So we're gonna actually start welding this now 
So we just went to Harbor Freight, got this Flux 125 welder. We got a mask and some gloves and welding helmet. So this is pretty much sturdy already, you know what I mean? But there's material that needs to be added right here. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get the metal that we cut off and add it to here. And then the other side, we're going to actually try to um, slice these up and weld it to here. All right guys, so we got the BRZ on the floor. And as you can see, we got some all right fitment right now. <laughs> uh, the rear definitely needs to go lower. We're not gonna worry about that right now. And we also need like a spacer because it's still not wide enough. So I think we need a spacer in the front, spacer in the back, but the body kit came out really, really good. Even lines all around. I mean, this is our first time working with the Rocket Bunny kit and uh, it was pretty easy to install. Much easier than the Rally Backer kit just because there's less pieces and that's pretty much it. <laughs> yeah man, I did have to do some sanding on the kit on just to make the make it sit flush on the car. So I was just sanding the back edges. All right guys, so here's the finished product. Got the whole front of the wide body Rally Backer. Got the Conse wheels. Uh, basically Joel's old setup, but on Brandon's car. And then we got the Rocket Bunny rear with the Conseys. Looks like a good good setup. Definitely need some spacers and it'll be lower, but uh, we'll work on fitment later. This thing looks pretty dope. I really like this spoiler too. It came out really, really good. Uh, we just used uh, some 3M tape. Looks really good, guys. I'm gonna take some photos now, make it look good for this before and after, but Hell yeah, this thing came out perfect. It was a little bit of a pain just because uh, we had to do some welding on stuff and first time doing that, so it was fun. I liked it a lot. So yeah guys, that's pretty much it. Plans for this thing are to get it painted. So we're gonna be doing that eventually. I don't know how long Brandon's gonna wait till he gets it painted, but it's gonna be a nice color. And man, this thing's crazy. So uh, we'll see this thing later. We'll see, it, we'll see it back on the channel once it's painted and color matched, everything's all good. Um, he's actually going for a new color, so we just kept the wrap in the front just because, why not, you know what I mean? Uh, he's gonna be taking that off later eventually, so yeah, man. I'm sad to see this kit go, but hey, we got we got a new one coming over there, so it's gonna be a hot video. You guys need to watch that one, but dang, man. So we got the wheels going too. We really like these wheels, but time to go on to bigger, better things. So 
that's gonna be it for today's video guys hope you guys enjoyed it uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions on anything that we did today uh, leave it in the comment section and uh, yeah that's pretty much it guys I'll see you in the next one peace